The lineup for Evolution France 2025 has been announced, and it has Mortal Kombat players upset. You will never win. I was actually going to do another video, but I had to touch on this because a lot of Mortal Kombat players are upset that MK will not be a part of Evolution France 2025. The lineup, of course, is led by Street Fighter 6 and Tekken 8. There's also going to be Guilty Gear Strive, Dragon Ball Fighters, surprisingly. Uh, there's going to be Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising and Fatal Fury City of the Wolves. So Mortal Kombat 1 did not make the cut as a main game at France Evolution 2025. And like I said, a lot of Mortal Kombat players are upset. Some people are saying that there should they should we should have our own evo if that makes any sense it's called final combat that's kind of already the mortal kombat world championship so we kind of already have our own evo and people online are just upset and saying that they don't respect mortal kombat but we kind of did this to ourselves because it's like pulling teeth to get players to show up at a mortal kombat offline event we have a lot of streamers who, and I don't want to name any names, but there are streamers who say it's a, it's a better financial decision to, instead of going to a tournament, to just stay home and stream and play online. And then, so you don't go to offline events and you don't encourage people to go to offline events. It just makes it seem like it's not fun to go to offline events. I mean, last EVO, we had Street Fighter Third Strike beat out Mortal Kombat 1 in entrance, which is a ridiculous thing to happen. For a lot of these games, players are showing up to play them for less money than Mortal Kombat 1 was providing in their Pro Tour. Going to these events is not a matter of being able to pay your bills off of the winnings. These events and these tournaments are supposed to be about the camaraderie of the community and meeting new people and playing games against characters and people that you never would normally and just having fun at these events meeting people who share the same passion and the same love for a game that you do but we don't really get that with Mortal Kombat it's like going to a movie or going to a theme park or something like that you don't go because it's a good financial decision you, you're actually losing money <laughs> by going you go because it's fun and you want to have that experience of going to that but with Mortal Kombat, it just feels like people won't get out of bed unless there's like a $10,000 prize pool or... I don't know. I don't know why players will not go to Mortal Kombat offline events. I don't know what needs to happen or what needs to be offered or how the tournament needs to be structured to get more people to go to offline events. But we cannot be surprised that EVO would cut Mortal Kombat when the participation has been so low. And it's been like this for a while now. So before everyone goes pointing the finger at EVO and saying EVO doesn't like uh, Mortal Kombat or France has something against Mortal Kombat or whatever the case may be, maybe we need to look at ourselves and perhaps start up a local or find a local near you and go to a local. And maybe you might actually enjoy playing offline with an actual person beside you. And then perhaps that translates into more people going to bigger Mortal Kombat tournaments. And then that will translate to more tournaments, including Mortal Kombat. Look, I'm bummed that Mortal Kombat won't be at this EVO, but I mean, the writing is on the wall, people. Like, we're not... <laughs> Mortal Kombat does not do the numbers that I think is representative of a tournament as prestigious as EVO. So we really got to start like a grassroots movement to get more players together offline, support your local offline, go to bigger events offline, and hopefully we can have a more rich tournament experience when it comes to Mortal Kombat. If you made it this far in the video, you can acknowledge me by hitting the like button. This is a small act for you. But this allows for videos like this to get more attention, and it is very much appreciated. You can hit confirm that into the subscribe button and join literally millions of Shinfit subscribers.
I post regularly and I do a lot of live streams as well as community posts. So to make sure that you catch everything as it comes out, go ahead and hit that sub button. If you're into gaming content, there's a video on screen now that I'm sure you're gonna love, but more importantly than everything else, don't get beat up out there.